This video is still in the chapter of vectors in vector spaces and we are going now we are working on orthogonality and we are going to make a series of proofs for a couple of um, concepts around orthogonality. Okay, very first one, show that the vector zero is orthogonal to every vector in the vector space. I think I did this in a previous video, but nevertheless I'm going to do it again. Okay, or I'm going to do it in a quick way. So what is vector zero? Please do not mistake number zero and vector zero. What is vector? So I'm putting a, an arrow on the top of the zero to make a difference with the vector zero. So vector zero is the vector where all the components are zero. And what is vector u? Well, an arbitrary vector in the vector space Rn is the vector with the components u1, u2, un. OK, question. What is zero inner product with u? So that will be the inner product, right? Zero times u1, so zero times u1. 0 times u2 till 0 times un and that will be 0 plus 0 plus 0 so that will be 0. As you can see there are two different zeros. This is vector 0 and this is number 0. Okay, So since z vector 0 times u uh, dot product, inner product with u, with any arbitrary with an arbitrary vector in the vector space Rn is 0, so 0 is orthogonal to every vector in Rn. And that concludes the proof. Uh, there is a totally different question here. If we are asked to show that 0 is the only that's a totally different thing. The only. So I'm going to rewrite all this. So a totally different question is, show that the zero vector is the only vector orthogonal to every vector in Rn. OK, so we already showed that zero is orthogonal to every vector in Rn. Okay, we already showed this. So 0 is orthogonal to every vector in Rn. Okay, now for our proof, okay, now we have to prove that this 0 is the only one that is orthogonal to every vector. Let us say there is another vector, let's call it u, and let us say that this arbitrary vector, or there is one, not an arbitrary, I'm sorry, there is one vector in the vector space, a particular vector in the vector space, that is, and that belongs to the vector space Rn, and that it is orthogonal to all vectors in the vector space. Okay, so if u is orthogonal to all vectors, u is orthogonal to itself. So it means that u times u equals zero. If u is orthogonal to all vectors in Rn, u is orthogonal to itself. OK, but we already proved that the norm of u equals 0 uh, if uh, and only if u is 0. OK. So this happens only if u is 0. We already proved that uh, the inner product of u with itself, so u times u, is always greater or equal to 0. And u times u is 0 if and only if u is 0. OK, so this will happen if and only if u is 0. So this completes the proof. So the, the only vector 
that is orthogonal to every vector in Rn is vector 0.